All right, guys, summer is here, and it brought the heat with it. Let me tell you, as we all know, it's only going to get hotter from this point forward. So we need to go over the tips and tricks to beat the heat. Uh, number one, very key element in life, staying hydrated. I see some of you already brought some coolers. That is great. I love that you're taking care of yourselves. And Ricky, looks like you've got the biggest cooler out of them all. Why don't you go ahead and tell these other guys what staying hydrated means to you? What's hydration mean to me? Let's hear it, boys. I got the big angle out for this heat wave, all right? In this bad boy here, four monsters, three cans of Red Bull, the tall boys. Okay, six beer for as soon as I leave the gate on the way home. I'm hydrated, boys. I'm hydrated, caffeinated, and fucking motivated. So let's do this thing. Woo! Absolutely terrible advice. Do not listen to that dumb shit. Energy drinks will dehydrate you faster than anything else. It is actually better to not drink anything at all instead of drinking an energy drink most of the time. So, water. Water is what you need. Drink a bottle before lunch, drink a bottle after lunch. If you get thirsty throughout the day, have another. Don't turn yourself into a camel. You don't have to chug eight glasses a day. That's a made up thing. But you do need to keep your water content up when it's hotter. So, uh, moving on to point two, dressing appropriately. So uh, I see a lot of people out here. Roscoe, I see you're dressed appropriately today. So why don't you go ahead and tell us what all your years of experience have taught you about working in the heat. Well, if you're hot, put a long sleeve on because when you sweat, you'll cool off. And if you just want to take your shirt off when you work with me, that's fine. All right, so you were, you were going on the right path and then you just jumped off the cliff with that one. Guys, keep your clothes on, okay? UV rays, UV index, it's high this time of year. Wear long sleeves, lighter colors, fabrics made of cotton, something light that doesn't stick to you, okay? You want to stay protected from the sun. And on that topic, we're gonna go to number three, sunscreen. It's a big deal, okay? You don't wanna get out here and get sunburned, sun blisters. It's gonna hurt, it's gonna make you miserable, it's terrible. So I've actually brought some sunscreen with me to this safety meeting. If anybody here has any hard to reach places or just wants some help, I can help you put the sunscreen on. It's no big deal. It's part of my job. Does, does anybody else need help putting some sunscreen on? Uh, Ricky, I know you're gonna be out there all day today. Would you like me to rub some sunscreen on you? Uh, no thanks, Buffalo Bob. It does not put the lotions on my skin. All right, what, what kind of weird fucking fantasies are you living? You're barking up the wrong tree, okay? Why don't you go ahead and talk to Roscoe? Because he's a very questionable motherfucker when it comes to shit like that. Shit. Yeah, I think he wants some lotion. Jesus. Been a long time since I had somebody rub lotion on me. We're going to have a good time. We're going to have a great time. Okay, all right. Uh, we're just gonna do like the back of your neck or something, a hard to reach area. Uh, I'm starting to maybe think that the rumors about you in the 70s may have some merit behind them, but I am not into job site rumors. I don't believe them, I don't listen to them. Uh, but personal question though, do you always go commando under the overalls or is today just a happy accident for you? That'd be right, son. All them undergarments block the breeze in the summer months. I like the freedom. It's one of my harder to reach areas too. Mm -hmm. Okay, yep, I figured that's where this was leading to. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and write you down as dying of fucking heat stroke. Because that's what's gonna happen before I put lotion anywhere on you, all right? And as well, we're gonna go ahead and knock it back to coronavirus rules. Stay six feet away from me at all times from this point forward because you're giving off some real hostile energy right now, okay? Anyways, guys, remember Memorial Day weekend, Houston NRA conference. Do not fucking forget, we all have to be there at the car booth. Don't fuck up. Do not take a sick day. I will see you gentlemen later in the day, all right?